Hello people, I am Bharat Acharya. Welcome to our new video. So, in today's video, we are going to continue learning ARM 7 instructions. We have already seen data transfer instructions, we have seen branch instructions. Today, we are going to be seeing processing instructions, the instructions which you use in programs to do operations. We start with basic arithmetic instructions like add, subtract, add with carry and so on. You know how ARM instructions are. The first ones are always very simple. Within 4-5 minutes, the names start getting very confusing. Add EQ, S, add EQ, add S and so on. But like I have told you before in the previous instructions or previous videos, if you know how to understand those alphabets, these instructions are very simple. Never get scared. It's a superb instruction set to learn. Uh, the trick behind mastering an instruction set is to understand instructions, not mug up. Uh, now, I'm not boasting. But I know the instruction set of more than 10 processors. If you count all of them, that's easily more than 1000 instructions. How do I know so much? If you tell me any instruction out of those 1000, you give me the instruction, I'll tell you instantly what it does. This, it's not possible for a human being to buy heart all this. The only reason why I can say that fluently is because I've understood those instructions. That's what I tell students. Understand instructions, don't just buy heart them. So I'll be teaching you every instruction with its use. How will you use them in, an, say in a situation in a program? Then, after basic arithmetic, we will be looking at some complex instructions, the ordinary multiply instructions and then the long multiply instructions, which have an extra L in that. It's not just mul, it's M-U-L-L. -L. Now, what does that U does? What does that S do? You know, there's going to be one more S that comes on its side. There'll be another set of condition codes, etc. So, I'll be adding all of that and showing you how these complex instructions work with example, of course. Then we'll be going into logic instructions and or XOR and then various more as the instruction set, whatever it contains, I'll be teaching you each one of them again with their use, how to use them in programs. I keep telling students, if you understand the use of an instruction in a program, the instruction gets registered over here. Then it becomes very easy to reproduce it in the exam. And as I've told you before, again, I don't mind repeating it because it's important. Even in the classroom, I say this again and again. Know every instruction. You get this 10 mark question in the exam where they give you 4 to 5 instructions. Now, it doesn't come in every paper. I don't set the paper, neither do I know anybody who sets and I don't care about that. But I have experience of teaching the subject for 20 years. So, I know what I'm talking. You get this 10 mark question where you get 4 to 5 instructions. All you need to do is explain those instructions. Even if you're never going to use that instruction in your life, see to it that you know every instruction because a question like that gives you 10 out of 10 within minutes. The answer is so small plus it's an answer that gives full marks. There's no scope of cutting marks. This is what the instruction does. There is nothing more an examiner can expect. There's no circuit diagram. There's no big theory answer, anything of that sort. So these are questions which are much better than any theory questions to a question to attempt. A, because it's very fast to write this answer and B, because it gives you full marks. If you're in Bombay University, you have 8051 and ARM. I will show you papers. If you see yourself, you'll be able to get it where you get 10 mark question of 4 5 instructions of 8051, another 10 mark question of 4 5 instructions of ARM. Do you understand a student who knows all the instructions is at such a good position in the exam? You got 20 marks in less than 20 minutes, less than 20 minutes. And these are questions that give full marks. You have so much more time to attempt the remaining marks for the, in the exam. You are bound to score very well if you just know all the instructions. If you are in Bombay University, you have 8051 in ARM, that's about 185, 190 instructions altogether. No human being can by heart that. 190 instructions, go on, forget it. And even if you can, don't be proud, of, proud about it. That's the most stupid way of learning a subject. Understand the instructions. Understand the idea behind them. That's it. You look at the instruction, you'll be able to answer it. Not only today, even when you go for your interview, even when after two years you decide you want to switch your job into something else, you still, if you've understood the instruction, the moment you see it, you'll be able to answer what it does. Anyway, so that was my, uh, that's what is the scope of this video. Basic arithmetic instructions, multiply, long multiply, and then logic instructions. Now, we are about to start. Before that, uh, just wanted you to know, uh, this was an introduction. If you would want to watch the whole video, if you want to learn the whole subject from me, if you want to master the subject and enjoy learning it, come on my website. That's www.bharatacharyaeducation.com. The link will be given down below. All you need to do is register yourself as a user, select the ARM course, hit the subscribe button. Of course, there is a payment to it. Uh, this is professional service. So obviously, we kept a charge, but we kept a charge which is very low, something that is affordable by practically everybody at the same time makes this whole exercise viable for us to conduct. So anyway, you make the payment, you can make the payment using every possible way, Paytm, Google Pay, Phone Pay, uh, UPI, Beam, uh, 
net banking, debit card, credit card, everything works. The moment you make the payment, instantly the course becomes activated and then you can start watching the videos and enjoy learning and set yourself for the exam. Also with every video you get a PDF, with this video you will get a PDF of my book which has the instruction set of ARM with full written explanation with example of every instruction. So you watch the video, you understand the concept, then you hit the button open PDF, the PDF opens, you prepare the answer from exam point of view. So it's your one stop shop, you don't need anything other than your phone or your computer to prepare for yourself for the exam. Anyway, hope to see you there, regardless, <laughs> hope to see you there, regardless, wish you all the best, do well.